the number one cause of death in America. It's not homicide or drugs or, 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 or suicide. The number one death in America is sleep deprivation. Lack of sleep. Sleep deprivation. So how much, how much sleep does the body require? The, the universal order requires that you must be in bed 90 minutes after the sun go down to get the brain recharged after 12 midnight. You know the story of Cinderella? She's not back in the house by midnight. She turns into a pumpkin. After midnight. But when does the sun go down? It changes. It goes down different every day. On What's the season? average time it goes down? It varies. In the summertime, it goes what down. What about the wintertime? No. Well, in the wintertime, it's your shortest. In the wintertime, if the sun, let's say if the sun was down at 5.30, you got 90 minutes before you go to bed. So they should be in bed. At 90 minutes. By 7 o'clock. When do bears hibernate in the wintertime? Right? Not just lying in the bed. Okay. Sleeping. The All brain right. gets recharged. And then after that, the body starts purifying and cleansing itself. If you went to the doctor and got a blood test today, okay? When I did my, I did a fast for 100, and, I'm sorry, 82 days in a hospital in New Orleans because I wanted scientific data to find out what happens to the human body during starvation. And I never understood out of all the blood they was taking out of me, <laughs> the blood guy never showed up on time and I loved it because I couldn't stand a needle. Except when I went to bed at night, okay, he was there right forward to bed and I got up every morning at four o'clock. And he was there. So I asked the guy, I said, man, why do Dracula be late all the time getting blood? And here's what he told me. When you wake up in the morning, your blood sugar, when you sleep at night, your blood sugar builds up. And you use that all day long. And they wanted to know when I wake up, you know, how high was my blood sugar? And they want to know when I go to bed and how low. They found out on the fast it never dips. But you, listen, let, let me tell you something about sleep deprivation, okay? On the Oprah Winfrey show, there was an extreme case of sleep deprivation. See, here's what happened. <clears throat> when you go to sleep at night, after you get X amount of hours of sleep, a chemical is manufactured in the brain. Huh? Okay, you hear me? Mm -hmm. That's God's gift. Not to get that is the equivalent to running out of gas. So it takes you nine hours to get the complete. Complete. Get complete. complete. Let, let, me, let, me, let me raise this with This yeah. is good. But let me just finish, please. Okay. Yeah, please, please. Extreme on the open one for show of sleep deprivation. Every day, this guy's wife carries the child to preschool. Every day, he picks up the child every evening. Hmm? Mm -hmm. But on Thursday, he has to take the child to school. So one Thursday, he goes to pick the child up. The child hasn't been here, so he calls his wife, Susan. Um, I thought you was gonna, how come you didn't drop Mary on? Today's Thursday, sleep deprivation. He forgot the child was in the back of the car. He went to work, let the windows up, 106, the oh, child is dead. That's what happened? Sleep deprivation. And, and, and the reason most folks is not wealthy and out of poverty, because in sleep deprivation, you make quick decisions. So. What happens to someone, let's say, if they only get four or five hours of sleep? Some people tell you they don't need much sleep. Yeah, wait, wait, I don't believe hey, that, though. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. There's no. a universal order uh -huh. that put everything together, okay? And the universal order will not change its laws because of a human. 